<laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. A new device is working to help save lives. Yeah, it's designed to detect future drownings. Dina Kupfer is live in Elk Grove with more on this device. This is incredible, Dina. It really is. And the way that I actually found this, if you're familiar with the Olympic skier Bodie Miller, unfortunately, he lost his young daughter because of a drowning incident. And it was devastating, as you can imagine, for his family. They now have a young baby and they're teaching them to swim train. But he was somebody who was really behind this new piece of technology. It's called the Coral Manta. And it's right here on the edge of the pool. It's using solar power. And so you don't have to actually have it plugged into anything. It's totally self sufficient. And this helps to detect people in pools, specifically those who are drowning. So A.L. Golem, who is the founder and the CEO, came out today to talk to us about how he crafted this idea, and he is the engineer behind this. So, A.L., come on over. We're going to have the two kids behind us, too, Jalen and Drew. They're going to hop in because in about 15 seconds, this is going to set off an alarm to let us know that there are some kids in the water, right? Right. Basically, there are two types, there are two types of uh, alarm. The first one is when it detects someone, a person going into the water, then after a few seconds the alarm goes off. And this is to let the people, the, per, the parent, know that someone might be in the pool, they might not know it. But the main thing is that it's, it keeps on tracking everybody in the pool at all times. Mm -hmm. And whenever okay. there goes the, the, that's the entry alert, just, it's not an annoying one, just to let you know that someone is, is in the alarm. And I get it also into my phone. Okay, so he has an app on his phone. There's a device not only in the water, but also in the house. And so if there wasn't a parent outside at the time, it would let you know, hey, someone's in the pool. Right. Okay. But the, the main thing and what's new about it is that, uh, that it tracks people at 24 7. And the moment that it, it sees, Someone not moving at the bottom mm -hmm. for about 15 seconds. This is when a loud and long alarm would go off. Okay, so we're going to do a demonstration here. So Jalen, who is 10, he's standing here in the water. We actually have a rock at the bottom of the pool. Jalen, go ahead, grab that rock and stay under for at least 15 seconds. So you can do that now. So we are going to be demonstrating. Go ahead and go in, demonstrating what it would be like because, as you mentioned. When somebody is drowning, when somebody's in the water, it's not necessarily them flailing arms and legs. They may be water in, in their system, in their lungs, and underneath the water still. That, that is correct. Okay. There, there were, I mean, it just uh, uh, got out like at the edge of the, the time limit, but we still got it. Yes. But, but yes, I mean, when children are drowning, uh, they're not wave, typically they're not waving and screaming anything. They just go to the bottom and, and they sink to the bottom very quickly. Mm -hmm. and, and people, many, many uh, times people ask whether 15 seconds is too late. So it's important to know that brain, uh, uh, irreversible brain damage starts after about five minutes. So it's very crucial to know as soon as possible that someone is in distress and get him out from the water as yeah. soon as possible. Absolutely. So that notification also went to your phone. It's showing a picture of the person in the water. Jalen, great job, Drew. Thank you as well. Uh, we know that there are many layers to safety as well. This is just one piece of exactly. the safety element. Exactly. Um, I do want you to tell people how they can get a hold of you and how they can find this device. Well, very simple. They just go to coralmanta.com and, and they can read a lot. They can see videos from customers, a lot of uh, explanation about how it works, the technology behind it, uh, a lot of coverage that, that was around the world and just order it. Okay. Wow. So incredible. One, one more thing. It's very important to, to, to um, say that, that this is just another layer of safety. Yes. Um, there are layers of safety that start with uh, physical barriers and, and like fences and pool covers yeah. and, and of obviously parent uh, uh, supervision. But this is another new layer that was uh, of safety that is, is protecting while people are in the pool already yeah. that was never addressed before. Right, absolutely. Well, well done. Thank you so much for coming out and Thanks introducing for... yourself to our device that hopefully will help to save so many lives. Thank you so much. Again, coralmonta.com is where you need to go. And uh, this will hopefully continue to make waves, no pun intended, right. in saving people in the future. That's, it's that's a, pretty that's incredible. A great